Find the centroid of the plate, the center of the area, and you've got this hole cut in your plate. But still, I have a plate that's made up of rectangles, triangles, and circles, so I'm going to use composite body methods to do it. I'm going to break my plate up into three different pieces. The rectangle without a hole, the hole itself, and the triangle over on the right. The centroid of the rectangle is at one inch, two inches, so half of the total four height. The centroid of the circle is at one and three, and the centroid of the triangle is at two and two-thirds and one. Remember, a third of the way from both the big end at the bottom and the big end at the left. The area of the rectangle is two times four is eight. The area of the triangle is one half times two times three, which is three. Now the area of the circle, it, it's a hole. So my area is going to be negative. I have pi one half squared, pi r squared, negative. You multiply that out, this is eight minus zero point seven eight five four zero. 8, multiply the y bar column times the a column, and I have 16, minus 2.3562, and 3. Sum the sum of the a's, add up that column, you get 10.215. Sum of the x bar a's is 15.215. The sum of the y bar a's is 16.643, bearing in mind that that area is negative for the circle. So if you find x bar is 15.215 over 10.215, gives you 1.4895, and y bar will be 16.643 divided by 10.215 is 1.6294. Answer the question. The centroid of the plate is located at 1.49 inches to the right and 1.63 inches above the bottom left corner.